All five home teams triumphed in men's basketball Saturday with two of the games featuring matchups of ranked teams. Number eight, Kansas, pulled away from number 15, Baylor, over the last four minutes to post a 74-64 victory. The Jayhawks have a two-game lead in the standings headed into tonight's Big Monday game at West Virginia. The Mountaineers will try to bounce back from a 79-59 loss at Iowa State, which is alone in second in the standings. TCU had its best shooting game of the season, hitting 52% from the field and 78% from the line to surprise number 21 Oklahoma State 70-55. Kansas State swept the season series with number 17 Oklahoma. Marcus Foster's three-pointer in the final seconds beat the Sooners 59-56. And Texas got 25 points and 12 rebounds from freshman Miles Turner to beat Texas Tech 56-41. In women's basketball, third-ranked Baylor continued to roll. The Lady Bears crushed West Virginia 79-51 Sunday for their 23rd consecutive victory. Texas Tech completed a season sweep of Kansas State with a 74-68 overtime victory in Manhattan. On Saturday, second place Oklahoma rolled past TCU 77-54. Texas picked up a key road win with a 74-63 triumph at Kansas. And Oklahoma State knocked off Iowa State 60-48 in Stillwater. A couple of notable records set in softball over the weekend. Baylor's Lindsey Hayes set a school record with three homers Saturday against Jackson State, and the ninth-ranked Lady Bears won twice on Sunday to improve to 9-0. Kansas is 10-0, matching the best start in program history. Saturday's 25-12 victory over New Mexico State set a school record for runs, and three of the school record 23 hits were grand slams. Defending national champion Oklahoma's top-ranked gymnastics team is now a perfect 10-0, after Friday's victory over number 21 Kentucky in the Perfect 10 Challenge in Oklahoma City. For the Big 12 Digital Network, I'm Wendell Barnhouse.